Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to Energy First Golf. Energy First Impact Later. FO Golf Teaching System. Man, it's a really exciting time for us. We've got a lot of good stuff going on. I can't wait to do a really a new episode after today. But um, as you can see, today is the last of the video on the shot making release. So today we're going to talk about block draw. Block draw. All right. Hello, everyone. Thank you for watching this video. We now have a personal swing analysis and also we offer personal instructional video. We have our own golf gloves, belts, shirts, hats, and bucket hats. If you're interested, click, please click on the Shopify link below. And don't forget to click like and subscribe to our channel. And please continue watching this video. Uh, really, block draw is probably one of the most basic. What I mean by that is that, you know, when I was a kid, I played um, tennis for high school. I played tennis for a little bit for college. And when I pick up tennis, I mean, I pick up tennis for six months. I'm good. You know, I was able to do valley with, you know, teammates and players. You know, if you guys don't play tennis, when I say valley, it just means, you know, when you warm it up, try to warm up your strokes, you know, warm up your hand motion and just hit top spins. So, but when I learn golf, I'm like, well, how can I'm not consistent? You know, back then I always say that, you know, how can, how come I'm not consistent? But now I know because I didn't have enough control of the body. But today I'm going to show you guys the block draw. Block draw is really just like when I'm doing a tennis valley, just warming it up, you know, a block draw, just warming it up. There you go. I mean, it's such a easy concept it's a, such an easy movement It's the most basic of a golf swing just like it's the most basic when you play tennis just valleying right so um what is block draw block draw just means right now because i'm swinging i'm creating energy with my body and my leading factor over my hips and my core and then they're creating energy and then my arm just rotating and release now, because I'm so relaxed, I actually let the club release outward. It means the path is going to go out a little bit. Not on, not, it's not going to be at the zero degree path. So the club is always going to just go out a little bit. I'm really relaxed. You know, I'm just turning my body. Again, right now I have a iron in my hand. The truth is, all I'm doing, I'm just valleying with a golf club. I couldn't, done, I couldn't do this before. When I was younger, I started playing golf when I was 19. I always question, say, how can I play tennis for six months? I can valley with somebody. And I couldn't do this with golf. Been playing for six years. And none of my teachers was able to explain it to me. But it's really the most basic movement of a golf swing. All right. So let me explain into detail. Right. So here we go. Basically, I set up to the ball. I'm going to rotate my hips and my core. I get to here. And then, keeping everything structured, then I'm going to weight transfer, turn my body, and then my arms is going to rotate. As you can see, my arms is going to rotate and rotate through. But because I'm so relaxed, I'm allowing the energy to produce a centripetal resistance. So the club is going to go out a little bit and create a little bit draw. Right? If I go in, it becomes block fade. But today we're talking about block draw. Now remember, we use the terminology block. It's not the same as you say I'm blocking the shot. It's the block release and block spin. Blocking a shot is completely different. All right? So let's do the side view. As you can see, I'm going to rotate my hips and my core. Structure with my arms, relax, and downswing, weight transfer, sequence, body rotation, arm rotation. Look at that. You can see it. This is such a beautiful motion. And we already talked about this. The arms on the downswing, we're going to move and rotate, right? And a lot of times you will see a professional player, they always have the top hand, this hand, over the left hand, right? And again, when you're doing this movement right now, that's why we don't talk about impact or contact. Because when you're doing the release movement, 
There's no way, I repeat, there's no way you can focus on the impact or the ball or the contact. Otherwise, you are not going to release properly, which I know now I can never focus on the ball. Guys, remember, I started playing golf when I was 19. I already have hand-eye coordination. I worked out. I started working out when I was 16. I was. I used to be a gym rat. So my athleticism and my hand-eye coordination is so strong. But that's the reason why I'm like, how can I not understand the basic principle? How can I not valley with a golf club? But now I know. Because I don't know. And it's first impact later. I don't know the blot release. So I'm not able to do the valleying motion with a buddy. I'm just valleying. So you can see, right? So basically, that is the block draw, which for most tour player, LPGA, PGA tour player, it is the foundation, is the go to shot until they are more. Artistry, they're more mastery. Try to control the fade, you know, hitting a lot of cut fades, the block fades, rip fades. The block draw is the most basic movement of the golf swing. Again, if you guys have any questions, you know, leave a comment or also check out our channel, our video, our FO Golf Teaching System. We don't offer quick tips. You must understand golf. And we at FO Golf offer you all the necessary information for you to understand what golf swing and how do you play golf correctly if you play golf correctly there's really no such thing as course management okay and we're going to get into it i mean i believe our fun just started begin with fo golf man we are going to have so many good stuff coming up in all the future video we're going to have so much fun but today like i say Block jaw. All right, let's just do a couple times. I'll explain to you when I do it very slowly. My arms is connected, relaxed. Hip rotation, core rotation, hip rotation, core rotation. Look at that. There's was a block jaw right there, man. And to be honest with you, honest with you guys, golf is actually easy because if you understand how do you play valley the, the tennis ball and no one's hitting back at you, and then you go over there and do the same thing again. And just two putt. Now, if you want to make a living on the PGA Tour, LPGA Tour, you have to know how to putt. But to shoot low rounds of golf, it's not difficult. If you understand energy first, impact later, you're not supposed to try to hit the ball. You're supposed to throw the ball to the target with proper energy and release. All right. So that was block. Draw again, energy first, arm rotation, our motion of the path of the club. That's all. Now, if you get again, if you guys have any questions, check out our channel. We talked about all of those things muscular pressure, where your energy is coming from, how do you use your legs, how do you use your core, how do you use your butt muscles, how does the arm rotate. Everything is in this channel. All right, so don't forget to click like and subscribe to our channel. Click the button right here. And also have two suggest video if you want to know more about Energy First Golf. Um, Energy First Impact later. I will see you next time.